Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I would double the price of petrol. That would force everybody to take public transport. There would be less pollution, less congestion, and everybody would get to work in half the time. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, brilliant. Yeah, yeah. It makes sense, doesn't it? It really does make sense. If you think about it. What an interesting opinion. I'm going to pass that off as my own at some point in the future. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I'll tell you what you've got to do, right? You've got to force people out of their cars onto public transport. Huh? And you do that by doubling the price of petrol. Okay? Then the roads are less busy, there's less pollution, and journeys don't take nearly so long. What about people like me? It's just impractical to bring two-year-old twins into town on public transport. Yeah, but you're just thinking... I mean, Lawrence and I live in the country. We simply don't have any other way of getting around without a car. Well, there should be a system. Doubling the price of petrol? 5p on a gallon's bad enough. When do you think that up? Well, pollution is bad. Pollution? Where we live isn't polluted, Paul. And since the local bus service went, we simply don't have any other way of getting around. Oh, and how do you get around? Do you fly? <laughs> <laughs> Passing off opinions as your own never works. Face it, you can't cut it in the real world. Join the army now. <laughs>